Congratulations on that victory. Obviously, it didn't really go your way in the beginning when you turned it around. So, I guess what are the emotions now that the hard part of the playing solo? I think you kind of just said it, man. You just got to kind of let what happened happen. And uh, you got to roll the punch, literally. And so, you know, I got caught. I think it was right hands. I don't know. I'm just being down. I guess my head was there. Uh, so, you know, uh, once we got down, I was able to kind of just clear the cobwebs and kind of work from there. Is very very strong. I knew he was gonna be uh, he was gonna be strong. I didn't expect to hit with that shot, but I just knew I was like, going to get back up to my feet. I always have a chance. I always have a chance. Even from the bottom, like you're always gonna be uncomfortable position with me. Like I'm gonna try to hit you wherever I can. And I think that that was kind of bothering him a little bit too. And it's just, I, I wanted to kind of just beat you everywhere. You might have hit me, but I'm still here. I'm still punching in the face. So that's kind of where I went. And even when you when he was walking out the broadcast, like he, like you mentioned, like they just kept talking about how strong he was in there just from his past fight. So when you did get him, when you were finally in there with him, was he stronger than you expected? Like when you when you locked up, could you feel like the strength? No, but I, I obviously had a very high expectation of him being strong because I because I think that was the biggest attribute uh, coming to this fight. Uh, he's struck his with his striking okay, he's got a good his wrestling's really good, but honestly, his key is to really just keep you in the position that he puts you in. So, uh, like, whether it's on the back, like, he keeps you on your back, he knows how to do that too well. And I felt the strength there. Uh, same thing as the kid, like, I know that's where he's strong at. So, uh, I had really big guys, and including my brother, who's a big dude, uh, just hold me against the cage, you know, try to try to just hold me nice and work out and, and do those things. So, I felt it was the, the, the last one on the, on the punch that dropped you, was it just like you were out of position or was it, did he make you do something that was out of position or was it just a complete mistake on your part? It was kind of more of a mistake on my part. I kind of just, I was trying to just kind of ease into it a little bit. I was trying to get my jab going. I was trying to do a couple of different things. And I, I might have lost focus just for a minute because I, I thought I was out of range and I just, I just kind of didn't think that he was going to hit me. Uh, you know, and I was really wrong. So, <laughs> yeah. And you clipped him with the left hand right at the end of that round too. Did you see that opening coming, or did you just capitalize it in the moment? Yeah, I saw that coming. Uh, my coach saw that coming. Uh, we kind of talked about it uh, before the fight. We saw what might be there, and that was one of them. We decided to just set it up and uh, set the right hand. It was the body shot that dropped him with that also? What you got game plan for? <laughs> the last one, last one for me. Because what do you want the rest of your year to look like? I don't know, man. I, uh, I set up a, a cruise for my, for my wife. She, she sacrificed a lot uh, for her birthday in September. So we're going to do that. And if we want to get one you know, before that, maybe in August, I'm down. If not, we're going to have to wait for Where are you guys going? We're going to the Bahamas. So we, that was our honeymoon. So now we're going to go and uh, we're going to go back kind of it's on, on a cruise wing. So, you know. Thank you, sir. The commentary team was kind of talking about his power and what he was going to be, and it looked like they were waiting for him to drop these big shots. But then in turn, you dropped the biggest shots when it came to the striking. Do you feel some people maybe are not giving you enough credit for your striking? It, it's not really my call. I just know what I'm capable of at the end of the day. Like, God's given me a bunch of attributes, abilities, and it's up to me if I want to use them. I know I can put some chingasso around for people, man, and they, I can hurt them. Uh, but at the end of the day, I just do what I do best, and that's honestly hurt people, be violent, and, and uh, I feel like I have to do to do that today. A little hiccup in the beginning, but got done. After speaking of that shot, that, that I guess the little hiccup, how quickly did your head clear out after that shot? Was it pretty quick? A couple moments. Yeah, it was a couple moments. Uh, I, you know, as soon as you get the you really hit the mat, you're like, okay, that wasn't good. So then you know, you work from there. And, uh, I was good, you know, I was just kind of let it, because he was, at that point, he probably got excited, thought he was going to finish me after that. Uh, I've never had a fight. I've never, as long as I have I have breath, I've never had a fight, and I'm always going to keep trying to figure out how to get back up to my feet and, and win it. And uh, I think that kind of showed today. You know, I know it's just been a couple, you know, moments since fight's been over, but, you know, going back into, I guess, the gym after this, you know, what sort of things are you setting for yourself that you have to work from from this fight? Are there things that you noticed in the fight that you could have did a little bit better that you maybe weren't so happy with? And what were you the most happy about with tonight? 
honestly, like I, I, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Like I, I couldn't tell you. I don't remember a damn thing that happened. <laughs> uh, it was it's just chaos in there. You know, very fast pace in there. Uh, all I, all that I was happy about is that we got the win, uh, and we got it. We got it in a spectacular fashion, as as I always expect it to be. Uh, so I just you know hope everybody enjoyed it. I'm enjoying it now that it's over, and uh, we're good to go. I know you fought at bantamweight, featherweight, obviously lightweight. Is it is featherweight the one that you're gonna stick at now? That's the one, man. That's the one. Thank you. Uh, thank you guys. You guys have a good day.